You know, people say this is a good time to play Leicester with all their international players out, but do you subscribe to that? Are they still as tough? Yeah, I think they're still as tough. They've got a, they've got a great squad. You know, it's the set size of the Premiership you look at, you think, well, when they have international players away, they're still very strong, and Leicester's one of them. Um, they're going to come here down here with a, with a good squad and a, and a very hard side to beat, so we're going to have to be at the top of our game to, uh, to get that result. Last two times they've played at Adams Park against Wasps, it has been two wins for us, but really, really high scoring games, including last year's game, which you played in. Expecting more of the same this weekend, or is the weather going to dictate otherwise? Yeah, I think it could be slightly different. That was at the start of the year last year. Um, obviously, during the World Cup period, so again, they were slightly uh, deprived of a few players, but it showed how difficult it was even, even with that side out. And uh, yes, the weather could play a part. It depends what it's today. If the game was today, it would be an absolute shocker. But hopefully, by the weekend, uh, you know, there'll be a bit of sunshine and we can uh, play the rugby that obviously we want to play and the, and the crowd wants to see. We're five from five at home. Does that play any part in your pre-match uh, motivation speeches? Um, I think it just comes from you know we've we've had a good record at home this year. Uh, we, we we pride ourselves in our in our home record, and obviously uh, that's you know those are our go-to games. We have to be if we want to be putting ourselves in the positions we want to be putting ourselves in the uh, Premiership. We have to be winning our home games. So you know that's key to what we're doing. It doesn't really change my pre-match speak um, talk and stuff. It's it's, uh, it's, it's just down to us to, to make sure we put in those strong forms at home. What is the talk about this week? Where do you think they're going to come at us? I think you know you expect a physical battle from Leicester. It's always a, it's always a physical battle. They'll you know have a, a lot. They've got a lot of big ball carriers, a lot of strong ball carriers, and uh, you know they'll be looking to dominate us probably up front. Um, we've obviously got to match that, and if we can, I'm sure we've got the, the sort of pace and power and and, and finishers uh, in our team to uh, to sort of finish off the stuff that's created by our forwards. Good news today to see Nicky Robinson and Joe Simpson out training and hopefully back in some sort of mix for the next week. Um, the injury from this year is looking a lot healthier than it was last year. Yeah, well, obviously we had difficult times last year, but we're looking forward now. We've got, you know, those guys are back. You know, Stephen Jones is out there today. Um, there's a guys getting back, uh, you know, to full fitness and hopefully, as you say, we'll see some and um, then play some part this weekend. Who knows yet? You've got either side of you to the top premiership top try scorers there, which they're never short in reminding us of. Um, how do you how do you mind, how do you get on playing with those two outside you? Well, yeah, it takes a bit of pressure off me, but uh, no, they're they're obviously great finishers, and you know they've uh, they've done well this year, both uh, top try scorers, as you say, and uh, you know long may it continue. It's, it, the key is it, it continues into games like this. These are the games where you know they need to be uh, coming to the fore as much as they have you know, maybe in other games, and I'm sure they'll be pushing as hard as they can to uh, to one get on the score and two help the team as we can. And lastly, this, this period come for Christmas now, a lot of important games in different competitions. We've got those back-to-back -back Amelin games um, against Bayonne, Leicester this weekend, Exeter then Sale. Are you looking at it as a sort of a six-week crucial window? Um, we haven't really talked about that yet. Yes, obviously you look at it and, you, and when you say that, yes, it is a massive period for us. Um, we, we did that earlier in the season with, a, with another group of games and, and we came out pretty strong. I think we won the four out of four um, in that November period. Um, or just sorry, just before yeah. that. And uh, yeah, obviously this is a key key part of the part of the year for us. If we can um, do what we want to do in the next uh, six weeks, then we're going to be looking pretty strong in all, all comp in all competitions. So um, obviously it starts this weekend. We're not looking too far ahead. Leicester's a, a massive game for us, and it, it I think this in itself, this game in itself, could dictate um, where we're going to sort of finish in the league. It's, it's that crucial to us. So you know, not putting too much pressure on us but it is a massive game it's a massive game yeah. for us it's a massive game for them and uh, we're massively looking forward to it thanks Hugo thank you cheers